Now with your leading stories this evening, the co-founder of Economic Freedom Fighter and Deputy President Floyd Shivambu has resigned from the party to join Umkonto Esizwe party. Shivambu took it upon himself to confirm his resignation in a media briefing held at the EFF headquarters in Bramfontein earlier today. Now Shivambu did not outline the reasons behind his resignation. Need please be informed that I will not renew my membership of the EFF in Ward 44, which is one of the best performing wards in Johannesburg region. I also request to resign my position as Member of Parliament and all positions in the EFF. I will only do so after receiving a go-ahead from the organization because it is the EFF that deployed me to Parliament. I cherish and appreciate the work that we collectively did in the EFF and building a formidable organization. I believe the aspirations and vision contained in the organizational redesign document of the EFF can still be achieved. That the visions that are contained in the organizational redesign document of the EFF can still be achieved and that I believe so. That my non-renewal of EFF membership is not a vote of no confidence in the organization, but a revolutionary act that will allow progressive forces to unite and work towards the agenda for progressive and revolutionary change. So I'm going to be actively involved in Mkondo, which is a party, uh, and shape uh, its direction and the politics that are obtaining today in South Africa. So that is to end the uncertainty or speculations that have been obtaining in terms of what is going to happen. There is no specific position that have been assigned to me. There is no commitment or any promise of deployment to parliament or to anything. It's a decision that I have taken and I think and believe that it will add meaningful value to the progressive and revolutionary politics that must be pursued by all the progressive forces in South Africa. Now staying with the story, EFF President Julius Malema shared his stance on Shivumba's exit from the party, stating that he did not see this one coming. Devastated, looked like Malema further assured his supporters and members of the party that he will remain a firm member of the party. I stand before you to accept the decision of the Deputy President of the EFF, who has voluntarily resigned his positions and did not renew his membership. When he sent me a letter yesterday, I felt the same pain when I received the news of the passing away of my mother. Because Floyd, to me, is not just a comrade is a brother, and he will remain a brother even when he pursues his political career differently. We formed this organization together, and I've told him that resigning from the EFF is equal to resigning from himself, because this is his organization. The constitution of the EFF does not allow people to resign and join other political parties and come back to the party. But I've made this offer to Floyd that the day you decide to come back, you are more than welcome because you are not a member. You are a founder of this political party. So you are not our enemy, will never be your enemies, will continue to engage on different political and personal issues. We wish DP all of success. We know that wherever he's going is going to be of value. We have lost a valuable member as the EFF, but the show continues. This organization has got leadership. This organization has got structures, and the structures are seized with the process of preparing for conference. So be rest assured, tomorrow 
the doors of this building will still be opened. We are not closing this building today and we're not closing this building tomorrow. It will remain here as a monument for the struggle for economic freedom in our lifetime. So I want to repeat, I will be buried with the flag of the EFF. My coffin will be trapped with the flag of the EFF and I will never turn my back on my people.